Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So for today, as you can see in the title, um, I'm going to show you guys what it's like to be working in the new, new normal, especially for people in the entertainment industry. Today I'm going to be shooting for one of the brands that I endorse called Birch Tree. Um, but I officially went back to work yesterday for Ajinomoto. It's just that I was too excited to start shooting so I didn't get to film it. But today I kind of wanted to take you guys through the whole process and show you what adjustments we are making to adjust to the new normal and to make it a safe place for us to all work together harmoniously. It's about 6.30 a.m. in the morning and we're on our way to Ateoni's house. For now, she is my assistant because my real assistant, Atejen, just gave birth a few weeks ago. So we're giving her some time to rest and it's really not safe for her to be working with her current situation. As you can see right now, one of the new, newest adjustments we all have to make is by wearing a face mask. And I believe this is the proper way to wear it. There's like a technique with how you tie the ends right here to make sure that the mask really sticks to your face and that there's no gaps where the virus can get through. Okay guys, so I'll see you in a bit as soon as we get to Ateoni's place. And then I'll be back to you guys once we get to the shoot. Good morning, Po. <laughs> Do not enter. Hello. Ayan na si Princess Perry palakpakan. Hi Tito Brent. Hi. Guys, siya yung nag-trending na hairstylist nung 2016 na Star Magic Ball. Yung gumawa ng yung gumawa ng hairstyle ko nung nag bangs ako tas nakaano ako dress na my pockets. Siya yon. Na interview siya sa TV Patrol. He's very famous around the world. <laughs> Thirty years in the industry. Okay, so we're going to start our makeup and hair for today. Okay, we're done. This is the final look for Liza. Lip balm. Only lip balm. <laughs> Wala nang idadagdag pa. Yan na yun. Glowing lang. So, ito na yun. <laughs> One, so kailangan before the meeting, the choir is kailangan to sterilize lahat na ang gagamitin kay Poppy. Mm -hmm. Ayan. So, after ya, saka mo gagamitin. Tapos, so lahat yung mga yan, nakalabel. Mm -hmm. How about sa sarili mo? Ano yung mga changes na kailangan mong gawin para safe ka at protected ka sa mga shoots? Requiring kasi sa amin eh, sa production, lalo na sa glamping, kasi kami yung mas malapit, kami yung malapit sa artista. So, mm -hmm. actually mandatory na nga ngayon mm -hmm. na magsuot ng face mask and face shield. Mm -hmm. And, kasi sa inyo, pag nasa work, nasa duty talaga, kailangan na kapit TV. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you! So, <laughs> ang, ang weird pala mag-vlog. Kaya nga eh. Yeah. Alam mo yun, hindi naman talaga kailangan mag-makeup. Kaya lang may, may camera. Sige na nga, mag-makeup na ako. Sisipagan ko talaga to today, ha. <laughs> Para sulit. Kunwari lang talaga to eh. Kunwari itong makeup po, ha. Hindi, pero mabilis na talaga kami mag-makeup ni Hopi kasi wala masyadong makeup ang gusto nila. Si natural, fresh, light lang na look. Kaya... Mm -hmm. Dapat mukha lang siyang ano, bagong gisen, gano'n. Mm -hmm. Ikaw, Tito Miki, what are some of the safety precautions that you have to follow for our shoots? Alam mo, yung pinaka-first step talaga, para mabuo yung shoot na to, swab test na talaga yung pinaka-standard nila, para lang mas sigurado. Mm -hmm. Actually, di ko nga napakita yun sa vlog. The day before yesterday, we all had a swab test um, for our shoot today and yesterday. So, thank God lahat naman kami negative. Sa lahat ng negative, yun ang makakatuwa. Yes. Ang ganda ng ito mo yun. 
Spotify. <laughs> Ang ganda ng pasok mo dun eh. Pero it doesn't mean na pag negative ka, eh safe ka na, hindi ka uh-huh. na makahawa ulit. Yeah. Sabi nga nila, di ba kailangan dapat ano ka, i-consider mo yung sarili mo na positive ka para mm-hmm. hindi ka, para aware ka sa mga taong kasama yeah. mo. Yeah. Like yeah. kami, unlike before, nakamask lang kami. Now, kailangan na naka-facial talaga. Kasi si, si, si Hopi, wala siyang suot na kahit ano. So, pinaka-delikado to. Mm-hmm. So, dapat yung protection namin is mas, mas mm-hmm. todo pa. Yeah. Yeah. Parang more than thinking about protecting yourself, you have to think about protecting others. Yeah, mm-hmm. kasi pag once na nagka-problema sa trabaho, parang pala ako yung mawawala ng trabaho. Parang yeah. Yeah, we're done. Ito na yun. Yeah. <laughs> so we're on. We're going to the set oh. now. <laughs> Ito na talaga yun. Fit lang. And I'm almost done. Completely done with my makeup. Just a few finishing touches left. And then I'll tour you guys around the studio. Oh no, I'm gonna change first and then tour you guys a bit of around the studio. There's not much to show, but at least you guys have an idea of what happens. Okay, so this is the final look. And we're about to go on set now. So this is what it looks like. Very limited ng mga tao. Um, there's no client. It's just, it's just two people from the agency and then the glam team, DJ Pascual, the photographer, and his two assistants. So what we do nowadays during the shoot is yes. BJ is online on Zoom and he is screen sharing with the client so that they can see what's happening at the shoot. Yes, right? <laughs> layout and I just want to limit my contact without any shield or mask whatsoever with other people so I'm just going to eat alone here while the rest are eating in the little cafeteria. So I'm going to wash my hands first. <laughs> location I was supposed to finish the vlog at the studio um, well I did get to shoot the closing spiel but then when I was playing it back on the way home I realized that I had bad audio the whole time and it wasn't focused on me so I thought of finishing it here I mean that gives me the perfect opportunity to give you guys a little bit of tips on how to you know make sure that you're extra safe the moment you get home from from work so what I like to do as soon as I get home is take a shower in hot water so that it can kill any bacteria or viruses that may be thriving on my skin or on my hands or wherever. Second is I make sure that I brush my teeth. I actually haven't yet. I'm about to do so. Dr. Steve Markgan from GAOC gave me this and he told me to take this every morning when I wake up and every night when I get home from work or wherever I came from. This is just to be you know, extra safe and make sure that you gargle any of the bacteria or possibly the virus that's in your mouth or in your tonsils. So, let's get to brushing. Okay, I'm done brushing my teeth and now for the, can you see it? That's about 10 ml. Focus and gargle. Okay guys, so I'm about ready for bed now, but one more tip that I wanted to share with you before I end this video is this. It's a it's tea <laughs> and it has honey and lemon in it, but I like to add additional honey and lemon to it because honey and lemon are just such good natural antibacterial agents and it just helps lessen the paranoia I feel. And I also read articles online saying that we're supposed to constantly keep our throats and mouths 
wet because if ever you do have the virus in your mouth, as long as you flush it with water and bring it to your stomach, the acid should be able to kill that virus. Yeah, that's what I like to do and um, that's how I keep myself safe from catching the virus. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you guys learned a few things. Hopefully things that you guys can use, especially for those who are going back to work right now. And yeah, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed. <laughs> I'm still super new to this whole vlogging thing and I feel like I suck at it, but you guys have been showing me so much love and support and it just makes me, it inspires me to make more videos and I can't wait for you guys to see the next episodes. And yeah, that's it. I have nothing else to say. I miss all of you guys. I love you guys and I hope to see you all soon, but please stay home, stay healthy and stay safe.